porque tenía un problema bien serio y por eso yo me mantenía con una presión bien alta. Me daban convulsiones. Yo casi no salía mucho así de fuera porque cuando acordaba ya estaba en el suelo. Pues la, doctriz, la doctora Patricia ha estado de, a, a, atenta a mí, pues gracias a Dios ella se ha, se ha prestado para atendernos, porque me atiende a mí y atiende a mi esposo. Ella está pendiente cuando me voy a hacer el examen de sangre y me sale alta, me llama, ven. Vamos a ver por qué esta cosa te está, se te va disparando tanto. No que me siento algo optimista, pues porque la doctora nos lleva con control de que no pasemos muy, no se nos suba mucho. Ya no ocupo porque vaya voy con la doctora Patricia y platicamos y ella me entiende. Lo especial que hay porque la doctora es muy cariñosa conmigo. Ella sí que es todo con nosotros, tanto conmigo como con mi esposo. Pues yo le agradezco a la doctora porque ella está al cuidado de nosotros, de estar al cuidado de, de su medicina, de las citas. Y pues yo le agradezco mucho a la doctora y a la clínica porque está siempre abierta para nosotros. Y pues por eso yo agradezco a Dios por, por ese cuidado que han tenido conmigo. Pues, si no hubiera sido la, la clínica que yo fui a dar allí y los médicos, pues yo ya no existiera. Estoy muy, muy contenta, muy agradecida con todo. Y Dios les va a bendecir en gran manera. I was a bodybuilder before, and I had, and I was muscular, and, and and even my face, everything changed after I had cancer. I couldn't walk. It took me forever. I couldn't pick up a two and a half pound weight. I couldn't do anything. I'm an orchid grower, and, and I did living orchid arrangements for private clients. And I had, I had a business for 30 years that I did that. Once I had to stop working, my income stopped, and it was like this is not fair to my husband. This is not fair to my family. Yeah, I was, I really thought about ending it, you know, like getting out and just leaving the planet. You know, am I really going to be accepted? Am I going to feel comfortable? And, And will I be able to be honest with what's going on? And I'm, I was totally able to do that here. Ellie right away listened to everything that I said. She's knowledgeable. I love, she makes me laugh all the time. I feel like Lolly's my protector. Any, any problems I've ever had, I go right to Lolly, and Lolly's I've always solved it. Ilka really helped me with my depression and got me into a survivor's group. We started to do Qigong. It's my meditation, my exercise, my peace of mind. She's helped me realize that I have a lot to be grateful for, that I can continue, that my problems are fixable. My HIV is stable and my cancer is stable and and I'm not so afraid of the world anymore. I actually started to golf. I feel great. My mind feels good. I I just feel like a different person. If I didn't have the team, I I would have been lost. Yeah, they all helped me survive. When I was 19 years old, 
went to a rheumatologist who diagnosed me with psoriatic arthritis. He also told me that I would be in a wheelchair by the age of 30, which was really discouraging. And it's a pretty horrible thing to tell someone who's that fragile at that young of an age. My body was in so much pain that I couldn't move my fingers, my, I couldn't drive anymore. I didn't really know what to do. I was looking for answers, but I didn't really know how to change my life. Amy actually saw me probably at my worst. I would sit in her office and just bawl and say, I can't move my arms, like I'm in so much pain. And she started crying <laughs> when I was crying and she held my hands and just said like, we're gonna do everything we can to make you better. And she meant it and she, she really did it, it's awesome. And I was starting to go to UCSF and I was single for the first time in years and I was doing all of this stuff on my own and it was, it was really overwhelming. having someone listen and care about where you're at and where you're going and really pay attention to you and to be heard when you're struggling and in life and everything seems really challenging. Aaron really helped me a, a lot. I've been a full-time student for this is my second semester now. Got straight A's last semester. <laughs> I've never been treated with such kindness and with such compassion and so sincerely. It's really surprising how much a difference that, that makes. Really connecting with your patients can change, help change their lives. Change mine. <laughs>